Here we have a really nice modern Italian instrument. This is a 1920 Romeo Antonazzi. And this is a really nice example of this maker's work. He's a very important maker in the modern Italian instruments from Cremona. Very sought after these days, very well respected. This is a really good sounding instrument. Very clear, very powerful. This is an instrument well suited for orchestra work, solo work. Something I really like about this instrument is the cleanliness of the handwork. This is a great example of an Antonazzi. I like the Guarneri pattern on this particular instrument. Nice arching, beautiful F holes, really clean corners, and really great symmetry. Great example of modern Cremonese work. The scroll though is particularly very nice to me. I really like how deeply cut it is. The symmetry is really, really good. Just a beautiful, beautiful example of this maker's work. And you can see that he took a lot of care and patience with this particular instrument. The wood quality in this instrument as well is very, very good. The top is a really very tight grain, especially in the center, fluting out to slightly medium wide width. Very straight grain spruce, really nice. Maple on the back, beautiful maple, good refraction, nice ribs all the way around. Really clean, such a classic Cremonese look. Just a beautiful instrument. The playability of this instrument is really great. It's very well balanced. It's very light. It's very easy to get around on. I like the upper bouts on this instrument quite a lot. Given this instrument's wonderful tone and ease of playability, it's uniquely Antoniazzi. This is a great addition to the Gatchel collection. <laughs>